Hi everybody, I'm going to show you how to install a network printer in Ubuntu 12.10. You have two ways of going about it. One way is to open up the, the uh, printers application. Just open up the um, Behost and then choose printers. And then you can click add network printer. Find network printer. Okay, we have the, uh, we can find it right here. I'm, I'm going to install the, uh, the um, Okidata C5150. It's a laser printer, black and white. I mean, it's actually a color laser printer. And we can do it this way, or another option is to open up your web browser in case all the features don't work and type in localhost colon 631. I tend to have a little more luck going this way, so I'm going to go ahead and use this one. Add printer. You got to enter your username and password you used when you first installed Ubuntu. Discover network printer, the C5150. Continue. Uh, for some reason, like on Linux Mint 14, this way is better, and uh, sometimes with Ubuntu, this way is better. So we're going to go ahead and just use the standard printer uh, application that came with Ubuntu, and we'll see if, it, if the uh, duplexer works. Okay, right now it's searching for drivers. Okay, you're going to scroll down until you see Okie Data, Okie, Ford, and uh, if anybody has a C5150N, you use the 5200 drivers. There is no 5150, but the 5200s work just fine. And I'm going to call it Theater Room. Apply. Okay, now it's asking me if I'd like to print a test page. I'll hit print. Test page submitted. And, um, it, okay, now you can hear the, uh, the printer opening up. But what I want to do is I want to see if the duplexer is working. So hit OK. And now we're going to go to printer options. Okay, duplexer, long edge. Okay, the duplexer option works just fine using the normal install. I want to use color, and for my color mode, 300 by 300, for a laser, this is just fine. Hit apply. The defaults are set. You can even check your ink and toner levels. The image drums and the uh, standard I see I've got plenty of black and white, color, everything else, because I'm always using the uh, simple mode. Allow printer for everyone except these users. Don't even worry about these. Everything is set. Hit OK and you're done. That's how you install a network printer in Ubuntu. It's easy, it's simple, and it's quick. We will not use this version because you saw the other one work just fine. 